Good morning, everybody. It's Tina and Charlie from the Prairie. Today is Monday, August the 13th, 2012. I hope you all are doing great. I am locked in my bathroom. Well, not locked. The door's open, but shut. Um, it's been crazy here on our, for our first today. Oh, Lord. Charlie is in trouble because he ran out the gate last night and almost got hit by a tractor. That mind you was speeding. So he ended up having to go in his pen because his muscles are really hard. Now I'll have to tell a story about Charlie because he um, he was a rescue. He, this is his third home. He his forever home. We ha we, I promised him a forever home. It literally tears my house apart. So he didn't get to watch Rob's video last night, so we'll have to watch that. But Charlie, look at that mug. You guys have to see. Look at that. Look at that thing. I know, I'm sorry to talk baby talk, but probably is really annoying. Okay. Yes. So hi Dexter. Hi five. Dexter. Come on. Come on. You always go crazy at the screen. Now you're being kind of Charlie. He's humble. He got in trouble. Okay, they say the dogs look like their owners. Really? No, I don't think so. <laughs> okay. Anyway, um, Charlie is going to get to watch Robin Dexter for a little bit. If we, if we can, otherwise I'll be this afternoon. No, you can't see No, I know, no. We're watching the world, okay? 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 Oh, no. Um, I'm going to talk about my way and I weighed in this morning and I am not happy with the scale. My scale doesn't have a name. It's a her. I know that. But, uh, anyway. I think there's a lot of factors behind it. Let me just, um, I can't find a piece of paper, too, that has all my stats on it. And I think it got mixed up in my daughter's, um, oh, it's a school starts a week from tomorrow. I'm going to go to fair. We're going to be at fair, you know, this week. And it's just, um, they pop all her stuff up to clean up her backpacks and get the new stuff ready. And I, and I had my stuff down the dining room table, and I just think it got mixed up. How did I get thrown away that it got mixed up? So I don't have, like, my everyday, like, oh, you know, a week ago I weighed this. I can't, I can't remember. <laughs> and, like, back in May, on May 15th, I weighed this. I have it all right now. Hopefully I find it. That's so squeaky. I'm sorry. Um, anyway, I started my journey. And um, for those of you that are new to my channel, welcome and thank you for watching. And thanks for um, all the continued love and support. I started my journey August 2010. I weighed in at 350 pounds. I um, started doing HCG, HCG drops. For those of you that don't know what they are, there's a little bottle and you put them under your tongue throughout the day and it's supposed to burn fat or lose weight. I did lose weight, but I probably would have given it all back now if I had it started doing what I'm doing now. Um, and I stopped drinking soda in May of 2010 and I choose now, um, I was addicted to a Thai Coke and a Diet Dr. Pepper. I choose now to not partake in any of that. My main things, I do drink coffee and I do drink um, water. I put lime in it, lemon. I like iced tea as well. I don't think it's that it's fun. I don't use real sugar. I don't think the tea is with a lot in it. just straight tea. Um, today I weighed in at 227.4. So frustrated with that number. Um, I kicked on my memory. I, I, I had gotten down a few weeks ago. Oh, it was probably not three weeks. I was down to 223.9. I was really excited about that because I want to be in the team, you know, by the time I go back to the gym. So, um, you know, 219, 218 was kind of in my head, and then I can, you know, get down from there. But um, the doctor told me that with my brachioplasty, I am five weeks out today, that um, around the six week mark, you can start re getting fluidy and start, or fluidy, is that a word? I guess it gets really tight in there, which is what's happened with other patients before, and so it, it can happen. And 
I don't know. You know, I do now notice that they are feeling um, a little squishy. Um, so I don't know. That could be why I'm, I'm gaining or maintaining and not losing. Um, yeah, and I have started walking again. You know, I don't know. I'm thinking I'm going to go hiking. Just, you know, I, 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 they hurt. They start to hurt. So I don't know. But the pain actually with the, um, sorry, I've got dog hair, plug hair all over me. Um, they don't, I'm not in pain anymore. I, um, I'm all on track with the, you know, constipation stuff's all gone. I'm, that's all, all good. I'm so thankful for that. I know now with my next surgery, I'm, the next procedure, I'm known now to take, you know, still soft and pain meds, which is something I have to take. Um, so that's all good. And my water's good. I drink 120 plus ounces a day. I'm really big into water. I know as big as some people aren't. Um, I'm in the fit, quote, fitness world, and I know that my trainer and the other builders are uh, builders. The other people who lift heavy weights drink a lot of water. <laughs> because I don't want you to think I'm like a bodybuilder, because that's not, you know, that's not. Um, I want to be a power lifter. Which is just um, lifting, and you can go online and type in powerlifting where it's lifting the big bars and stuff like that. That's that's what I want to do: deadlifting and powerlifting. So that's kind of going to be my sport. And uh, anyway, I, I, I digress a little bit here. Um, you know, this forgetting thing didn't start till I turned like 40, and that's the truth. That is the truth. I'm 44, and I'm like, I forget. I'm talking away, and it's like, what's up with that? I'm looking at myself, and I have no makeup on. We do have a skylight, though. But there are some of I apologize. Well, let me show you. Okay, I forgot what I, I just, I, I really told, I'm sorry, and I, I'm not going to redo this video. So I can't, I honestly can't remember what I was just saying. So, okay, let me show you there. This is my right arm. Double. Okay, see that? No, I don't know. Yeah, I'm on. Yeah, that's better. Bubbles here, which I I look at my videos back and I'm like, oh, I look so huge and I think it's just uh, the way we look on camera, maybe the way I look on camera. Maybe I, because my family and people who know me in person say, you, they look really good. So you look huge when I'm showing them to you. Um, so, yeah, I don't know if it's just the camera or something. But anyway, the okay, well, while I'm really, really pleased I did it, you know, I think after my surgery, I was nervous and didn't wasn't excited that I did it, but now I'm glad that I did it. So, um, anyway, I want to just, as far as the weight gain goes, I'm just going to keep doing, you know, I'm tweaking a few little things, but um, I'm just going to keep doing what I'm doing, and I'm going to, you know, walk. I've got my Fitbit. Oh, yeah, I'm on rock. Sorry. Got my Fitbit. I got the big one. I got the big one. Um, no, it's, it's, it's good, and I'm loving it, so. Okay. Anyway, it's just been kind of crazy here on our ranch, and I'm going to videotape. I'm going to probably not make, I won't make another video like this till next week. I'm then going to videotape us down at the fair, um, you know, and I'll just do a little tidbit, and then I don't know how to do the editing yet, so, um, yeah. Dottie, you need to come help me. <laughs> um, I, I need help with that. Um, and uh, anyway, yeah. And I just watched Becky's video too. She does some good editing. I'm not very good at it. Anyway, um, yes, we have, um, I'll just give you a little farm update. We have a fox that sits out in our pasture and looks at us and knows apparently that we can't shoot it because apparently we are not allowed to shoot the foxes unless it's on, on, on like, has the animal in its mouth. 
So it looks, it's just that walk back and forth on the ridge, like watching us. You know, we have lambs out there and such, but there's nothing we can do about that. This morning, so we have to have a live trap because somebody's killing our chickens, and we raise organic chickens, and so we sell our eggs, and we, you know, we, we do not want our chickens to die. So we um, have a live trap that's trying to catch whatever it is that's killing our chickens. Well, the fox won't fit in our live trap. And he's smart. He doesn't like tuna. But um, apparently the skunks like tuna, and this morning we caught a little baby skunk. Okay, now I know this is probably the preschool teacher in me, because I love Disney movies, but this little stuff is like little flower. <laughs> Something to be. And he's no longer with us. But now, the big thing. That little stuff, oh, oh my word. So my husband and my father in law are out there. They're, making, they're trying to kill the stink on the stuff so we can get it into the something and get it to the dump. Charlie is locked in here because, I mean, of course, you know, we don't want the dogs anywhere near it. But um, it's just one thing after another. I mean, we had a storm come through the other night. We did not have any tornadoes, but the clouds are looking really, um, you know, you get those tornado watches, and that's kind of, that's scary that tornado watches, but we didn't have a tornado. I'm going to go. Because I'm not alone anymore. Okay. Bye, you guys. Keep back, keep doing great. Love you. Bye.